because you really enjoyed my last video, where I styled a Chanel runway outfit using only things I already have in my wardrobe, I shall style another runway outfit for you today. Today, it'll be this Dior outfit. It's from the Spring Summer 2018 collection, and I love it. So, let's dive right in. Let's do it! First step, we need a classic shirt. One that doesn't have breast pockets, because we don't want the breast pockets to interfere with the layer on top. This vintage men's shirt is the only one I have that doesn't have breast pockets. And now you might be saying, Andrea, this shirt doesn't look like what the Dior model is wearing, to which I say, it doesn't matter. Because when we recreate looks, we only take inspiration from the original and we want to infuse our own spice into the outfit. And you know Andrea is a fan of raffoliciousness. Gorgeous. Okay, next step. We need an A-line skirt. This one even has a slit, just like the Dior one. Nice. Now, before we continue with the upper part, let's work on the shoes. Because you don't want to put on shoes, boots for that matter, when you're all cinched in. Not very comfortable. Not good. So the model is wearing knee-high lace-up boots. I only have one pair. You're probably already sick of them. These vintage lace-up boots. So let's pop them on. But let's try and recreate the open lace kind of situation that's going on here. So what we do is we hide this middle part in the side of the boots. And then we lace up the boots, ensuring that we leave a little gap in the middle. Let me show you. And I'm not sure it's gonna work, but let's see. Sometimes fashion is about experimenting and having fun. It'll take a moment to get it right. It didn't work. I couldn't really make the gaps happen throughout the boot. So let's lace them up as usual. Still, it was worth a try. Okay, so the boots are finally on. That's already a cool outfit. Very 2024. Because this year, we'll be seeing a lot of maxi skirts paired with long tops. So essentially, slouchy chic. Very comfy. I like it. And especially good for those who don't like accentuating their waist. Okay, let's have another look at the model. Right, we need a corset. This beaded one is the only black corset I have. And I think we can make it work. Shove, 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 pull, 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 pull. Adjust, adjust. Nice. Now we need a belt. Horst. I'm coming. Okay, very nice. Now I know the model has a black belt buckle, but I feel like crystals. And so crystals, it is. That's already really nice. Now, as you can see, we need a long beaded necklace. I'm going to use this vintage necklace that I got for one pound because it matches the beads in the corset. Now we need a hat. Gorgeous. A bag that matches both the black beads and the white of the shirt. And we're done. What do we think? A big thank you to all our patrons for supporting us. And thanks for watching. Bye!